All right. Well, here's our profit and loss for the month. Um, so we have our income. This, again, is what we've billed, but does not tell us what we actually received. So um, what we've actually received to date for sewer fees is $172,914. Um, what we've billed is one hundred and sixty. Sixty-nine thousand seven hundred and fifty-five. So we've received a little over three thousand more than what we've billed last year. I don't, or last month, I don't know if you guys recalled that for our water income, we were significantly off, and that was due to a billing error that we caught of like fourteen thousand dollars. Yeah. Yeah. 14, so we went in there, got it all fixed. So um, our water looks much more reasonable uh, this month. So it says total build is around 237, almost 238,000. And then what we've received is 235,000. So that's about 2000 less than what we've built for. So that's it for our income side. Then we go into our expenses, um, sewer maintenance. It looks like, uh, of this total portion here, uh, 5,043 is for pumping and tank repair, and then just $13 um, for locates. Then of uh, our water maintenance, it looks like uh, 1,340 was for testing, 208 on meter supplies, $59 on other miscellaneous supplies, and then we had some repairs, 4,950, um, and then 215 for delinquent posting. So going to the property um, and then also going to turn them off. Uh, vehicle expense dropped significantly this month, so that's nice. Um, it's 106. <clears throat> our contract labor is just 50. That, uh, uh, that was our lawn mowing that we had for one week out of the month, so it wasn't the usual 200 for the month. Um, director's fees, 250. Dues and subscription, 1899 for Intuit and Zoom. System operator, 7000 every month. Postage and delivery. Uh, printing and production was due to the uh, Coeur d'Alene Press posting the budget and the public hearing for that. Um, then we did pay our quarterly DEQ water assessment fees. We paid for the number of connections and we paid 470 quarterly. Uh, we had our office cleaning, office supplies, um, then telephone, electric, payroll, um, Total expenses, uh, 30,822. So, <laughs> any questions? Did the, the, the jade invoices make it on this, or where we got it? Only one of the jade invoices was for October, and then the rest of the invoices I put for November. So, yeah, I've been hounding Jade, which I showed you guys those invoices, but it totaled 47500 He got behind over the entire summer, and I have been hounding and hounding and hounding. So that was a summer's worth of work. Summer's worth of work, yeah. Basically, um, a lot of fires to put out and things like that. They're, they're trying to clean up, but they, let's get the fires out. We'll figure out the bill. Yeah, later. so he, was, he would bill us for, like, the emergency repairs and water line breaks and things like that, but all the routine meter installations that we have throughout the year, um, we needed those, so... Um, Clint looked briefly over them. Um, there are a couple that we will be going to the customer and requesting more funds from them because their connection took more than the $5,000 deposit. So he estimated around $5,000 would be reimbursed back on those. So, um, that's something he'll be with like months. It's like something we just from again while putting in there with that's going yeah. expensive. So he'll be working on that this week. Um, but yeah, so that'll all show up on next month's report when I talk about, well, I'll go a little more in depth, uh, for next month's because it is our closeout for the fiscal year. So we'll look at the budget compared to it and everything. Our fiscal year is the end of November. Okay. Yeah. I was wondering that. Yeah. So. I wonder why it's not December. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> a lot of, a lot of cities and districts do that it's kind of funny i guess well i i can see why it'd be really nice for auditors if everyone had the same fiscal year end it would just be insane so there's purpose on that one 
but yeah, so speaking of, uh, our, uh, pre-auditors reached out to me and asked if we'd be recruiting their services this year, Coeur Books. Um, I suspect we would be. I don't see why not. I mean, we spent so much time training them, and then they reworked our financial statements and stuff for Colleen's desires, so I suspect that we'll be going with them this year. Okay. All right. All right. Are you with us, Kyle? 